Okay, first I made, just made a video um, about this pet peeve I have with people that try to quote the dictionary in philosophical conversations, but, you know, I'm just going to throw that video away and make this. Listen, it's very simple. I have a commenter. He's in my uh, point that reality is, is an idea, that when we talk about reality, we're referring to an idea. You know, he says, just look in the dictionary. Okay, listen. Uh, we have had... Uh, an idea about reality such that for thousands of years, if not millions, we have mistaken our model of reality for the thing itself, the thing being modeled, okay? I am arguing that now that we know that there is this separation, that these distinctions, that we need terms to take those distinctions into account. So I'm saying we have to change our understanding of this term because the term is about ideas and now we have an improved ideas and the terms have to catch up. And I do this really openly. You know, I don't just start using a new definition. No, I'm making something specifically about the definition, specifically about my arguments with the definition. So, of course, you know, we can have any word mean anything we want. And I'm making suggestions. The main thing is, do we agree with the model? And what do we do? And what's not acceptable to me is that we still use the traditional definition of reality because it blurs and ignores a very important distinction about what's going on. So obviously, if you look up the word in the dictionary, since it's not the expert opinion, it's the common use opinion, it is the traditional view, or supposed to be if it's a decent dictionary, of course I'm going to disagree with that. That's the whole point. That's the whole point of my video. Of course I'm disagreeing with that term, and I'm doing so really directly. And you act like, well, I just didn't think of looking in the dictionary, which is moronic. You think terms, we can't argue about what terms should mean or how the ideas should be understood? That's ridiculous. And I, I don't expect you to understand that, but, but that's the point. For all this time we've been talking about reality, we thought we were talking about the real world. We were really talking about our model of the real world. And, you know, it's time for us to admit it. We can just admit it. Admit that we were talking about our model of the world all along. Just admit that. You know, and, and you can assign the, the, the sound reality to the material world if you want, but then you're going to have to talk about reality differently. You can't talk about what something is. You'll have to just talk about the facts, just the facts. You'll have to say, I saw red and I see this shape and here is the evidence. You'll have to speak very scientifically, basically. And as soon as you make a, a, a statement about what all that evidence means, you're talking about the model that you have in your head. That's the point. We can change the definitions around however we want so long as we start acknowledging this distinction. But the definition of reality in the dictionary doesn't acknowledge that distinction, and therefore it's not going to stand. It is not an option. It is not one of the options going forward.